So have you heard the viral story about Kai Sinat that is blowing up? And Kai Sinat is the biggest streamer in the world right now. And his friend uh, and one of his videographers got caught talking to minors. What? Yeah. And so this story is wild because you got to understand Kai Sinat right now is running the world. Mm -hmm. Everything. This is the guy that shut down New York City, you know, with basically a tweet and had riots coming because there were so many kids that came outside. This is the guy right now. His, him and his team are the biggest streamers, probably some of the biggest celebrities in the world. Kevin Hart was just on his show. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Every big rapper wants to be on this show. Every big celebrity wants to be on this show. Literally, it is the most popping thing in the meta. And it is beautiful because the team that put this together and Kaisen had itself, the team is called Amp. That's his group of guys that all stream with him. Okay. He, he's kind of one of the, 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 the bigger guys in the group, but they're all big, they're all big creators. Kaisen and, and, and the team is named Amp, and Amp are a group of young black men who are running entertainment mm. in the new in, in new age entertainment. No TV, no radio, no 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 guidelines. Nobody gets to control uh, what they do, and they're running it. And Kai has been through this multiple times where he's finding out that the people around him are doing bad things, and then these are the type of things that can completely ruin his career. We just had Mr. Beast, the biggest YouTuber in the world, just get caught with one of his closest workers, I mean, with one of his closest employees and his best friend getting caught talking to minors. My guy. And now you have Kai Sinat, a young black man trying to do the same thing, and finds his cameraman was trying to talk to a minor. And so... It was heartbreaking for him because you literally have these black men at the top of success mm -hmm. and working so hard and then finding out the people around them aren't ready and could be the reason why all of this stops. Because one guy doing that is mm -hmm. enough to sink this whole ship. They're, when you're at the top, they're looking for a reason to tear you down. Right. So this is the and I'm and so we have Kais and that responding to it, which I'm going to play. But first, I want to kind of go through what happened and who his cameraman is. This is Chris V. And he was caught talking to a minor. So allegedly... What happened with the girl was she contacted, they, the girl kind of hit on him. Mm -hmm. They met and started talking. Originally, she lied about her age. Okay. Then he finds out, but the second he finds out, he doesn't end the conversation. And he continues to have that conversation, and um, it would end up biting him in the ass. So this is the conversation. So, uh, allegedly, like, the girl recognized him. I think he was out somewhere, and she recognized him, and they ended up ex exchanging emails. Mm -hmm. And he was surprised because, you know, he's the cameraman, and she recognized him and knew who he was. So, th they started inboxing, and this is the conversation. So, and this is, well, this is where she, this is where she tells him her real age. So, they're talking, and he's telling her how he really wants to get to know her. And then she says, oh, laugh out my loud, oh, laugh out loud. Um, you cool, but respectfully, I'm actually 17. My friends told me to say I'm 19, but you know, I gotta let you know the truth. Now nah, that's crazy. I respect you telling me though, no cap. Yeah, I didn't want to do you like that. You cool though, good vibes, laugh out loud. I was actually serious though, if you was 19. So then, so that was, that's the part of the conversation that she sent, right? That's mm -hmm. the part of the conversation that we know. Now, what would fast forward and Kai is going through all of this stuff. Kai's blown up. He's big. She messes Kai out of the blue and tells Kai this. Hi, Kai. I recently seen a clip about you speaking on Ava slash Mr. B situation. That's the streamer I told you about who just got caught up because his best friend turned trans, then found out that the trans friend was trying to talk to minors back in the day <laughs> as they were building a company. Okay. That's a lot, but we'll continue on this story. So, uh, I do wanted to let you know that, so this is, you know, Kai's friend. Uh, and so Kai had talked about it. And so I guess she saw that stream and was like, well, let me tell you about your friend who was doing the same thing as exactly. <laughs> so I, uh, I wanted to let you know that Chris, your cameraman, is definitely a pedo too. I remember coming across him on the OMI TV when I was on Discord sharing my screen to my friends. They told me what his name. They told me that his name is Chris and that he is Amp's cameraman. I said hi, Chris, which got his attention because he was curious how I knew his name. He asked for my age. A lot because I was 19 because my friends told me to and I just went with it. He asked for my Insta, I gave it, and as soon as he DM'd me, and as soon as he DM'd me, I told him my real age because I know it's not really cool to lie about that. And from there, I thought he was going to stop answering. But then it led to him being down for a one versus one on COD, which I thought was fine. COD is a game. Okay. 
Later on, it turned out to him being flirtatious and then texting me wild shit you wouldn't say to a minor. During this time, I just turned 17. I am now 19. This happened December 2021 Feb to February. Uh, this happened December 2021, February to March 2022. I will gladly show you all the screenshots I have to prove this. We also used to FaceTime. I remember there was a time he passed the phone to you when I was telling you that I could also beat you on a 1v1. I don't know if this helps to remember me. That's a lot, right? A lot. <laughs> so Kai gets his information. And you understand. This is potentially, not even potentially, realistically, these guys are building a hundred million dollars. And even right now, a hundred million dollar corporation. This is millions of dollars on the table. Yeah. These guys have they Kai's and that a couple weeks ago had Kevin Hart on his stream for hours, dancing yes. and playing. Like you this is not where we cannot have this on the on the team. Right. So um Kaisen that gets his information. He decides to investigate and then, you know, takes it to his people. And this video is very, very, very sad watching him have to deal with mm. his friend letting him down and having this happen. And I believe something similar to this happened to him before where wow. I, I think uh, one of his, one, like, I don't remember what happened, but I think it was like one of the guys that was, you know, on the staff had did something and it came out later. And it, that was actually pretty recent too, but I don't know exactly what happened. So I'm not going to speak on it, but this is sad to watch him as he builds what he's built. And everybody loves it. This is, you know, it's, 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 it's dope to watch someone do what he's doing. That's so young and be so successful. Mm -hmm. And, um, just to watch what's happening to him. And this clip is crazy. Relax, bro. Apparently in 2021, this nigga, this nigga was caught talking to somebody that's not the age of consent. Nigga, it gets bad because she lied about her age. She said she was 19. She lied about her age. She ended up saying her age. Said she was 17. Right then on, right then on, right at that moment, you're supposed to stop texting. Right at that moment, you're supposed to drop all conversation. Anything that's below, that's below the age of consent, you're not supposed to talk to them. It is not cool. You're not supposed to talk to them. You're not supposed to do anything. You're not supposed to engage in any conf uh, any conversation. Not on a different type of like. You're not supposed to just. It's just not right to do. And none of this shit is is fucking. You can't have no excuse for it. You can't have nothing. You can't have no say so. There's nothing to back this shit up. There's nothing in a positive way to, to do this. When I seen this shit hit the internet, I was I just woke up. I seen this shit hit the internet. I looked at it. First thing I did was say, hey, let me sit down and let me get down to the bottom of this to completely confirm everything. Everything. I reached out to the person who went online and did all the other shit. Um, I reached out to her and shit. And she basically, she showed me every single thing. Um, I asked her to confirm the iMessage, to confirm the number. It's confirmed. All right? All that shit is confirmed. And I'm just sick and tired of having to do shit like this. Because it's like, damn, my nigga, like... Like, like just, like, like, I don't know how people are not just seeing something or like an age or something and just saying and just stopping you feel me gang like the whole fucking day shit fucked me up because like nigga what the fuck are you doing like what are you doing like nigga i had a i have a whole vision like how i want <sighs> i need to stop crying and shit like <laughs> i'm over here crying and shit Somebody who helped me start my whole shit. So yeah, it's a very Ooh. sad situation. <laughs> it's sad. Yeah. I felt his pain. My God. Okay. I felt that. I get it, man. I get it, G. But yeah, so it's a terrible situation. I don't know, and it ain't, and there's nothing you can do. And it's like at this stage of the game, I gotta cut you off. Got to. 
got and, to. And I got to cut you off for real. I can't and even. <laughs> I think that's why he was crying, y'all. It's like a true violation. Like, he started with this person. He wanted to end with this person, build with this person, and this person really let him down. Like, that's crazy. And then let the whole team down, man. Yeah. And then it's like, you got to cut him off because there's too many other people eating. It's too many of us. And if I let you stick around, you're going to endanger the entire ship. I can't stand by this. I can't stand on this. I can't help you. I got to yeah. just, I just got to feed you to the, and it's 2024, bro. There's no, like he said, like, even like, look, maybe there are some arguments to be had, but we can't have them. No. It don't matter. It don't matter yeah. if you never saw her. It don't matter if you never touched it. It don't matter if you, it don't matter. Right. We can't even talk about it. It's over. You you gonna cost us everything, right? You know what I'm saying. Like the moment she told you her real age, it, it should have stopped. Period. Over. You played yourself, and you and you you know what I'm saying. So I understand this pain. It's sad to watch that. I yeah. you know. And then like it's it's just when you're at that spot, it's everyone wants to see you fall. It's every it's the wolves come out, and so. I understand why he had to do what he had to do, mm -hmm. you know, and and unfortunately, you know, I'm pretty sure the guy thought that maybe not even thought that he I'm pretty sure he thought that he did something wrong. But I don't think he thought that it would ever come back because he didn't Damn. like if he didn't do anything like if right. he didn't go see her or nothing. He probably was thought, oh, this is some little thing. Nah, bro, this is the you got to be careful. And that's why it's important that you like really watch your actions and, and, and understand that, look, it may not mean nothing now, but in the future, it could change everything. So right. um, but we'll keep you guys updated as we get more information. Uh, we wish Kai the best. Yes. Um, but, and I'm pretty sure Amp will just be just as strong. I think he, the beautiful thing that I think Kai did, the most important thing is he came, he, uh, he investigated, addressed it, put it out, did it all himself. You know, you got to respect him. So, you know, I think he handled it in the best way so that he could, you know what I'm saying, and his team could survive. So, good, good on them.